and they sprinting away from the 1,000 meter marker. Black Velvet was very quick to respond. Kept Secret on the left is also right there. Cadiz in the middle of the track with the green cap among the leading division. They are followed by Cool and Fade to Grey. Then comes U Bolt, Golden Mirabilis, about three lengths off the leader. Spanish Cat is on the right hand side, and further back is here we are. As they get to the 500, Cadiz, just the leader, Black Velvet's on the inside. Kept Secret is still right there. Golden Mirabilis is going through between runners. Then U Bolt, Learn a Little is towards the outside, followed by Cool and Then here we are in Kaji. Fade to Grey over on the inside, and Cadiz now hit the front. Golden Mirabilis is going to throw out the challenge, then Black Velvet. Learn a little on the outside with Coolan, but it's Cadiz and Golden Mirabilis over the last hundred. Golden Mirabilis and Cadiz, nothing in it. And Yoey R is running on powerfully on the outside, but Golden Mirabilis won it. Second will go to Yoey R, Cadiz third, maybe Fade to Grey, and then Kept Secret. So victory is for number three, the toad favourite, Golden Mirabilis at 270, Garth Puller, Anthony Delpeche. Of course, these famous colours of the past moors, the horses of Regent's Air of Yesteryear and many other good sprinters. Cadiz stays on, but here we are, takes off to get beaten that half length into second. So second to number 12, here we are. Third position to Cadiz, Fade to Grey is involved, kept secrets on the inside. Tully Nally and Whistling Wonder, Cool and U Bolt. Black Velvet, no extra over the last hundred. And then came Learn a Little, followed by Rad Rock and Kaji. We'll take a look at that head on, and the winner is Golden Mirabilis. That's got the blue cap towards the left hand side. Cadiz is with the uh, light green cap or the green cap, and two off the right, really taking off in the latter stages. Here we are to get beaten that half length. That is the running of race number six. The winner, as I say, at 270, race time 5816, until race seven, back to the studio. has come through to notch up her third victory this afternoon. She looked to be the right one in an open looking field. Yeah, if you study your form, she's down in class. Uh, she's been running in mid rated 83s and 85s and holding her own, running very well. So I must say, um, I thought uh, obviously Dennis' uh, 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 horse was the one to beat, Dark Velvet, but uh, this, this filly was in with a big chance. And Anthony's services, thank you, very nice ride. We sat on her a little bit today because uh, she's been going to the front of the lightweights. I'd like to say thank you to Wayne from Woodbourne Manor. Um, he leased the filly to the guys, and these are staunch supporters of hers. And, and a big thank you to Brian Parsmo as well. Congratulations, Garth. Thank you very much. And obviously, um, Hollywood for their um, sponsorship, and all the guys back at home for their hard work, Gary included. Thank you. Super. There you have it from Goth Puller. Jockey Anthony Del Pesce is making his way back. He's ridden Golden Mirabilis this afternoon, and she's notched up her third career victory. And just looking today, you gave her a bit of a chance early? Yeah, uh, we spoke and it looked like there's a lot of speed in the race and and I just said, let me rather just follow the speed and I was always going very, very good. And yeah, she kicked on and she won a good race. She's one of those game little soldiers. Yeah, you know, I looked at her form and I thought the form really, really was strong and uh, I thought uh, Sean's filled his first time on the grass. Uh, that was the only concern and uh, I thought if I've got that beat, I, I'll win the race. Congratulations. Thanks very much. Thanks to Garth. He, he throws me a bone every now and then. I don't ride much work, so I really appreciate it. Congratulations. Thank you. And to my sponsor, haven't you? Well done. Let's get the winning connections. Who's going to come through and have a chat? They're all on the phone. They're getting their pictures taken. So let's get the representative. Well done. Congratulations. Coming to the course today, Garth and them are quite upbeat. Yeah, uh, we recorded wins now in Clearwood. Gravel and now Scottsville, so I'm really grateful. And I'd like to dedicate this uh, win to my new nephew, who's now seven days old. So he came to the soil last week, and, and he's going to be the future horse owner. Well, you've achieved it all. Now it's time to go turf and team Kenilworth. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> well done. Last word, sir? Yeah, no, just a bit of patience, as God said. Well done to Anthony Delpitch. Good ride. And uh, we're just grateful for the win. Well done. Well done. To God. Well done to Garth. <laughs> there we go. Well done to Garth and Anthony Delpesh. That's the call from the winning connections. Number three, Golden Mirabilis.